Hello everyone, welcome to the Elecro classroom. Today we will learn the application of the message display control. First, create a new project. Rename the project and modify the path. Select M series and select the corresponding type according to the screen size. Rename the page and add a background image. Add message display control. Add a button control to switch to the next page. Set the properties of the message display control. Set the contents of the four controls to different types. Test it out and see the effect. First click the run button to debug the virtual serial port. After the virtual window opens, click open the serial port. Then go back to the main page, click open device, so that virtual communication can be carried out. Click the instruction helper, select the text display 1. After determining the screen ID and control ID, start updating the content of the text control. The debugging is successful, exit the debugging, and prepare for the next step. Make basic settings for the switch button. Add a new background image for the new page. Also add a text display control. Add two button controls. Set the basic settings for the text display control. Input mode select system keyboard. Select digit keyboard. Set the input prompt to please input. Set the position of the keyboard.
Similarly, set the properties of the second text control. The difference is that the keyboard type selects the full keyboard. Set buttons to switch to the previous page and switch to the next page. Now start debugging. We see that the keyboard of the system can be directly called here for content input. Next, we gonna learn about ArtWord Display. Set the target page for switch button. Select Art Word Display as the background image. Here we will use WordArt to display text information. Similarly, add a text display control. Select Art Digit Display. Select the icon of WordArt. Set switch button's properties. Add a new page as the target page for next button. Rename the page to text increment adjustment. Ok, let's debug the effect of WordArt display. Through the instruction helper, enter different values.
The control displays the word art content. Finally, let's take a look at the text increment adjustment operation. Add button controls and text controls separately. Here, we control the increase or decrease of the text content by pressing keys. There are integer, decimal, time increase and decrease operations. Here we only show the operation method of integers, and the operation of decimals and time requires the cooperation of an external microcontroller to complete. Basic settings for text controls. Set up the button. Set the internal command, here you need to use. The instruction helper. Related operations, use the corresponding command. Here we need to control the reduction of the text value through the number 3 screen number 3 button control. We copy the generated command into the command box. The button that sets the increase also generates instructions, change the decrease to increase. Ok, let's see the effect. When we click the plus or minus button, the value changes accordingly. Well, we have learned the operation of the text control. Thanks for watching.